We are learning more about the pastor who was killed at his home in Lemon Grove. Police have arrested his wife in connection with his death. ABC 10 News reporter Marie Cornell is live at the Reformed Presbyterian Church. Marie, I know you spoke with a member of the church community. They must be devastated. They truly are, Virginia. The man I spoke with says that he worked closely with Noah Shepard. He says the community right now is just trying to come to terms and understand and process what has happened. But he says he truly was a good person. Monday evening, sheriff patrol cars and other emergency vehicles filled this Lemon Grove neighborhood of Camino de las Palmas. This was after investigators say Gabriela Shepard called 911 saying she had shot her husband Noah. Deputies say Gabriella told them she had thought Shepard was an intruder and was trying to get in the house from the backyard. Later that night, deputies came back to the house and arrested her on suspicion of murder. Noah was more than just a husband and father to two young kids. According to social media posts, he was also a valuable part of the Reformed Presbyterian Church. Members of this faith community say even though he hasn't been the pastor at this church for long, he was an excellent leader who was well respected. According to Noah's Facebook page, him and his wife have been married since 2016. We checked court records and the couple has had no prior domestic violence or restraining orders filed. His wife Gabriella is being held at Las Colinas without bail. And she is scheduled to be arraigned tomorrow afternoon. Live from Oak Park, Marie Cornell, ABC 10 News. Marie, our hearts go out to the children and the rest of the family. Do you know how the church is helping them? Yeah, well, Virginia, talking to this man, this member of the community, he says they are going to be accepting financial donations that will go towards funeral expenses, as well as for these kids who are at this point without both parents. Virginia. Thank you, Marie. We appreciate the update.